Wonder Creates and today I'm going to be unboxing my first ever, my first LOL surprise OMG doll. Okay, so I'm not really like a fashion doll collector or anything, but like these dolls kind of like intrigued me. So I've never seen like an LOL surprise OMG doll in real life before, so this is like exciting for me and the reason why I was kind of intrigued to like get this doll was because they look like Betty Boo and I like watching like old fashioned like retro cartoons and Betty Boo was like she she's an icon she's an icon and I really like the cartoony like the cartoony style like cuz other dolls like Barbie they're more like realistic while these are more like cartoony and I prefer like the more cartoony look and everything so this doll is like really like interesting and everything and again they look like Betty Boo <laughs> so I really want to see what this doll looks like so let's have a look at the box and get them out. So this doll is called Roller Chick. This is set one. Ensemble, they are series three. And I really love like this pattern. It's black and white. It's like Alice in Wonderland. I love like this color combination. I love black and white, by the way. So little, I, just, I, I like the packaging. <laughs> On the top left hand corner, it says there is 20 surprises. It says unbox fashions. And it says dress me. And it says strip your stuff. And it also tells you that the box is a reusable dressing room and under that it says package becomes a play set. So yeah, so that's the left hand side. On the right hand side we have LOL Surprise OMG which stands for Outrageous Minimal Girls, okay, <laughs> perfect. <laughs> and we have the picture of the doll here and it says, I'm a fashion doll. It's kind of like Honey Boo Boo, like I'm a beauty queen. So yeah, this is a little image here and it says, start here, comments. So I need to pull this, but like it's covered in like plastic. So I need to cut this off, I guess. So yeah, I'm gonna do that. Okay, so if we pull the slide. <gasps> oh my gosh. So they are called Roller Chick. It says fast sky. I can't read the sort of slang. Oh god. Skates. Fast skates. I dig good vibes. And fast skates. Oh, I dig good vibes. I was reading it completely wrong. Wow. Well, I've butchered that. I jive with BBs who, <laughs> who just <laughs> roll with it. Okay. 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 <laughs> So this is what, like, this is a little preview of what the doll looks like at home. I didn't realise they would be this colourful, because, I mean, I'm used to seeing, like, this dull box like this, like, the dull image, and then when you pull this tab, you see them in their fashionista glory. Like, look at oh, those, like, crystal balls, like, for ear bit. Right, but we are all going to have a closer look at the doll and everything, but when you pull it out, also, you can see, like, this side of the box as well. That's now revealed, so they are a Pisces and everything, so you can see some of that. Is that a hat box? <gasps> are you there? Oh my god, it's I love hats, so that's a hat box. <laughs> okay, so it also says at the bottom, warning, choking has a small parts, not for children under three years, and yeah, so this is, oh yeah, this is also an MGA product. Wow, I'm so good at this. <laughs> On the right hand side, we have a little, a little person here that says, hey sis. So yeah, that's them. They have their little roller skates on too. On the back of the box, we have LOL surprise again, OMG, 20 surprises. And it says, OMG, we sisters strut, be a style and stand out from the crowd. Cause we're here to surprise the world. And it has that in like other languages that I'm not going to attempt to read. And these are the other dolls that you can get in series three. So yeah. And finally, on the left hand side, it says roller chip. Okay, so now I'm gonna get them out of the box and also as a side note, there's like a little handle. So I, I like boxes with handles, so I, I like this little detail that they added so they can you can carry like the box and everything. And it did say that um this box is gonna be a play set a play set as well, so this may be useful. So I'm gonna get them out of the box now. Oh my god, they're sliding out. Wait, wait, I, I think you're gonna unbox them from the top. I'm new to this, okay, so yeah, I'm gonna unpackage them now. Okay, so I don't know if I'm doing this right. I think I'm like breaking it. So I've, I've kind of took the top off and everything's like falling apart. I don't, I'll, oh, I could use this for like a background for like my MLP video. Oh, I love this, I love this. Okay, right, 
Okay, I'm okay. So I'm. I think I'm lo low key breaking it. I don't know if I'm doing it right. I'm kind of scared. Okay, so yay. <laughs> um, what what's going on here? What what's going on? Oh oh okay okay. So that is that everything? I think that's everything. What is going on? Okay, so I think I managed to figure it out. <laughs> okay, so this is the little dressing room here. So on the front of the dressing room, it says dressing room. Yeah. <laughs> and there's this little person again that says stretch your stuff. So this is like the little side chick, right? Like we have roller chick and little side chick. I'm calling them the side chick. It's like, it's like a roadie or something. So if we open up this door, Oh, we have like a little clothes hanger image. Nice. And we have the doll. And they're in like a strike a strike me pose. Like I'm striking. I don't know if I'm making any sense, but okay. So <laughs> try not to get too excited. So I don't know what to open first. Should we open the surprises first? Or yeah, let's look at the accessories first. Arr. Okay, so I got all of the accessories out of the box now. So we have a hat box, a shoe box. A little like I don't know was this meant to be like a ma is this meant to be a magazine? It says Fashion Baby magazine. What's your store sign? So it's like a store sign magazine. So this little character that we have is a Pisces. I don't know much about astrology, so I don't know what that means. I don't know what traits a Pisces is supposedly allegedly meant to have or not. I don't know. And it says today's the day to try something new. Give it a whirl and keep ro keep on rolling. So that's a nice little motivational quote, quote there. <laughs> I also like in the magazine that they have like a tiny little barcode. Like I love the detail on this. So that's the magazine. And we have like two like outfits maybe. I think this one's meant to be like the trousers or the skirt or something. And this is like meant to be the shirt i don't know so we might have to we're, we're gonna find out it's gonna be a surprise so first i want to open the little shoe box and everything so this is what the shoe box looks like as apparently they are size six and a half roller skates so they have a barcode as well love that so let's open this box okay so we have paper we have it wrapped in paper i'm scared if i'm gonna lose anything <laughs> let's carefully unwrap these roller skates Okay, okay. Wow, okay, so So the roller skates, the wheels are not like rollable, which is kind of a shame. It would be so amazing like if these were legit like working wheels. <laughs> I'm like find it hard to speak today, I'm so sorry. So we have these blue and green coloured roller skates here. So that came in the shoe box. I love the little boxes by the way. <laughs> so them are the roller skates. So now let's open the hat box. So, so I'm guessing this is going to be like headphones, like the picture and everything. I wonder if there's any other accessories in the hat box as well. So let's have a look. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, I wasn't expecting this. <laughs> okay, so I was expecting headphones because I, I thought that would make more sense because it's in a hat box and it's like headgear and roller skates and like listening to music. Right, okay, no, no, never mind, never mind. No, no headphones. So we have the little like crystal ball like earrings in here. Very nice. We have a little sweatband or little bangle thing. Is that meant to be a sweatband? I don't know just don't just don't even ask that and we also have like two little i think these are going to be more like um bracelets i'm guessing yeah bracelets <laughs> and finally we have some little sunglasses look at them little heart chip sunglasses very nice very nice very nice and fancy <laughs> so accessories to the side now so now i really want to look at these outfits now this is actually like good paper like this isn't like toilet paper toilet paper or tissue paper this is like good this is pretty good quality paper it's not like wrapping paper this is like thick wrapping paper okay so let's i don't i really don't want to tear it but like i want to see what's inside and it's meant this is this is what it was made to do and everything i'm probably just going to keep this paper because i love it so much and oh my goodness <laughs> okay so this is that's it oh, <laughs> i love this so much it feels like really silky and I, oh so it's like a little bomber jacket and look at this it has it, it has like a 
Well, like like a ha 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 a body piece here for sort of like a little plastic uh, mold <laughs> we either have like a bomber jacket and look i just look at the detail and i love bomber jackets and it says see ya later oh my goodness i love that i, I love that i'm really intrigued to see what's in this one now oh Okay, so we have some fancy blue shimmery trousers. It kind of reminds me of like a fish, like a mermaid tail. It's kind of like a fishy sort of scaly sort of effect there. So yeah, but yeah, we have some shimmery blue trousers and it has some little pockets and they are actually legit like functional pockets. So you can like put like, I don't know, your little toothbrush in there or something. I don't know. <laughs> so that is all of the clothes and the little accessories. So yeah, now let's look at the doll. Okay, so opening the box of the doll. So, oh, what is this? Oh, we have more. We have more. Okay, so we're back. So on this side of the box, we obviously have the doll. And um, it came with this doll stand, which took me forever to figure out. And it also, I believe this is meant to be a bag. It says baby boutique. I thought like a boutique was meant to be like flowers, but I don't know. I think this is meant to be a bag. So let's have a little rummage. <gasps> okay, so it is a bag. It's like a little, it's just like a little fancy little bag. Um, I think it is openable. I'm pretty sure you, you got to open this. Like, I don't know what you will put inside of it, but surely you can open this like come on yes you can because there's like a little latch there so you can open the bag it's just that i can't open it oh say so there it is <gasps> it's like a pokeball but like pikachu has just left the building <laughs> so there's a nice little bag there nice and now let's look at the actual doll. Okay, so this doll has the most weirdest little hands ever. Like they're honestly like that they feel real and it makes me uncomfortable. Like like if you have like a pet like mouse, rat or hamster, it it literally feels like their hands, like little rat hands, like honestly. Like it feels so rubbery and real that it's uncanny <laughs> anyway they have these painted green nails and the knees of these dolls it's like a snap joint so you can like bend wow you didn't hear the snap it's like there so you can like snap the knees into position it's not much posability on these dolls not gonna lie but yes i like the snap joint on the knee because it's kind of like it's like a bit that's what they did with like the older dolls like in general for older fashion dolls to give them like the good old snap joint knee so love that love a good vintage thing coming back to light the legs so the legs can go forward they can go back but they cannot do like the splits or anything but so that's the only possibility of the legs they don't have any like hip joints so you kind of twist them i would really prefer if they had a hip joint because it's like my favorite like posability posability joint on dolls is like the hip joint so you can like turn them and everything and yeah just it get it gets you more like options if you do photography or anything so yeah the arms they can go up down all around and outward they have like little oh god oh. so they have like little elbows and you can move them and twist them and everything the hands they have a little joint as well i hate touching the hands because I, I hate touching the hands the heads on these dolls can do a full 360 but they can't really move like up or down like i don't like how i don't know if like I don't like how they're kind of like looking up like that i don't know if it's because of the weight of the hair but when i've tried to like straighten them up a bit i kind of damaged the neck a tiny bit as you can see right there when i tried to like bend them like that it kind of did that so you gotta be careful <laughs> i just want to say that i really do like the hair i like how it has like a fringe like i don't you don't see many dolls like well i don't see many dolls that has a fringe and under the fringe you can see their little tiny their little tiny penciled in pink eyebrows very straight very thin and also their makeup like the little eyeshadow is it eyeshadow i don't do makeup so i i don't know what to call anything but i think it's called eyeshadow i'm such a guru i know <laughs> i'm not 
but I like the colour yellow so if you have yellow eyeshadow it's always going to be good in my books that eyeliner as well nice little wing there look at the wing I love that so it's just you can it's like molded on like there's like a little it's like molded on but like painted over at the same time the face and like the eyes on these dolls I love the face off I love like I, I love the faces like look at that face look, look at that face it's just so like cartoony and I love like cartoons and this is way up my street like with the big eyes and just like yes I love that the hairstyle on this doll is pretty cool it's in these twisted rope braids however they are a bit not well done because some of the hairs like coming out of them so i may have to wash the hair and try to do these rope braids again see what i mean that is one long hair <gasps> it's still going on whoa that what why is this hair so long <laughs> and i really like the hair color and the little buns as well i love like really bright colors and everything and this is so vibrant and i'm like living for it the outfit looks really groovy like that is one funky looking top that like what what and they have like these little blue shorts and everything so yeah okay so i put the accessories on them and this is what they look like and i kid you not it was such a pain getting these earrings in i had to use the scissors okay to sharpen them up a bit so i can like fit them through the little ear hole and i don't think there's any way of getting them back out like they honestly the earrings are such a pain to get in and yeah so the earrings are a pain i had to do a bit of research to see what the little orange rings were for and apparently they're meant to be like hair ties for the hair like you're just meant to put them over the hair ties to look like a hair tie i, I don't get the point in that but okay so these are the sunglasses i really like them they do fit really snug there so yeah, this is what they look like in their original first outfit that they came with. I put the little roller skates on over the socks. I don't know if that looks weird. I don't know if it looks strange because like I think the sock is a bit like, it's, it's a bit ugh. And they also have the bag and the little bracelet. Okay, so I was going to change them in their other outfit, but I discovered that the top is actually a bodysuit. So this is like a swimwear outfit now. So yeah, it's like a bathing suit so they can do like the little roller skate and like near like the pool <laughs> or whatever. So yeah, I like the variations of outfits. So I wasn't expecting that. I didn't know that that was going to like... I, I, I just was not expecting that at all. So I'm, I'm pretty impressed that like this is a surprise again another surprise that they've given us more than one like outfit i was just expecting like two outfits but no they slid this one under the radar so that's nice so wow okay <laughs> and this is the last outfit with the bomber jacket and everything and the shimmery looking trousers so yeah that is them and this is them without the sunglasses look at that so majestic i know like amazing oh wow oh wow <laughs> The last thing to look at before we wrap up this video is the dressing room. So it's not really much, it's just like, it's a nice pattern, there's like a record there, the roller skates, a little stool, in a quite of a funky shape, everything. And here we have like a mirror and you can like peel it, so it's like a mirror, <laughs> so you can see the mirror better and everything. So yeah, that's the little play, the playroom, dressing room, the little play set for roller chicks so yeah i also forgot to mention they also come with a little plastic doll brush so yeah so that is about it for this video let me know if you have a lol omg doll <laughs> and my overall thoughts are is yeah i do like them because they look like betty boop they give me an 80s vibe and i love the 80s probably it's my favorite decade because you know my little pony came out back to the future david bowie and labyrinth <gasps> giving me life yes love a good mullet i i do really like mullets not every not not many people admit that they like mullets but i admit it i do love mullets and always have i never thought they were ugly guilty and all <laughs> also he-man came out and care bears came out like in the 80s too i think um i never watched care bears <laughs> so yeah i really like the 80s and the music is so like i, I love 80s music so 
Oh, wow. I love 80s music. <laughs> I really love the vibrant colours of this doll and I do like the cartoon sort of look and style. I just really like the faces on these dolls because it's very cartoony and like big eyes and they look really vibrant and I love like colourful things and they're so vibrant and the 80s. This reminds me of 80s and everything or... Oh. It's just, it's, I, I love this doll. I love this doll. <laughs> Will I be collecting more of these LOL OMG dolls in the future? Well, you see. <laughs> Originally, I wanted to find the Busy Baby doll because they looked more like vintagey and like had more of like a retro sort of look to them. And I was like, oh, I really want to get that one because I think that one's like my favourite one out of them all because it looks more retro and old fashioned and I like it. They kind of give me like a 40s or like a 50s sort of vibes. So I'm like, oh, I, I need to find that doll. But unfortunately, I couldn't find that one. So I got Roller Chick instead because they were the only one in the shop. So yeah. <laughs> so yeah, I will definitely try and get Busy Baby in the future. I don't want to like collect loads of them, by the way, because I only want to get the ones that I specifically like. Like I like... I like the baby one <laughs> and yeah if there's any like gothic looking ones I would probably like to get them ones as well so it's just I just want to get like certain ones that I would want instead of like ones that I'm just going to get for like the sake of it if you know what I mean so yeah um I'm probably going to start an unintentional collection of these maybe but it, yeah <laughs> So that is about it for this video, be free to leave a cheeky little like and a friendly little comment and if you haven't already, be free to subscribe to my YouTube channel, hooray! <laughs> I'm like Kermit the Frog. <laughs> so yeah, thank you all so much for watching and bye!